All right, we are going to get started. Welcome and thank you for joining us for our Beyond the Basics skincare session. Woohoo, skincare, always a fun topic. So, as always, as we're getting started, grab an oil and, um, or maybe you're diffusing something and drop it in the comments below what you've got tonight. I actually. I'm putting on a little blue lotus. Who was lucky enough to have this little gem, blue lotus? That's a really, mm, really nice one. So make sure you grab an oil, take a nice deep breath, and also grab a pen and paper. We're going to give you lots of info. As always, you'll get the recording and a PDF following this, but you might want to jot down some things um, that uh, you might want to put on your wish, wish list. And also I'm going to have one or two just tips that aren't in the slides. So you may want to jot those down as well, including one of my favorite recipes that I came upon that I just have written down in my notes on my phone. So there's no slide. So you may want to have a pen handy for that. Um, so the other thing, and it's really instrumental when we talk about skincare is your water, 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 water. I'm no skincare expert, but I do know that one of the best things that we can do, not just for our overall health, of course, but for our skin is to drink water. So, cheers. So I love talking about the doTERRA skincare products and the skincare lines, and it's something that we, especially as women, um, we, we buy a lot of, a lot of us buy a lot of skincare anyway. We experiment with skincare and we have all kinds of different skincare needs and they change over the years. So I'm excited to go through this because doTERRA has some really awesome options. And so it's going to be nice to share them with you. And um, I'm going to just kick it off by telling you what I just did tonight before we got on the call in terms of my own like little skincare routine. And this is, I have various routines, but this is one that I do. And I just did that tonight, this tonight. So um, tonight I actually, you and I have no makeup, just going on the video with no makeup. Not that I'm a huge makeup wearer anyways, but um, what I do find is, especially as we age, the more we take care of our skin, the less we need stuff like makeup. So um, I used the doTERRA mud mask tonight. Drop a, drop a yay if you've ever used this mud mask. Um, it is really um, wonderful for detoxifying and purifying. It's like a clay mask if you haven't tried it. And you only need to keep it on for three to five minutes. And then you just wipe it right off. And then I followed that with my Immortel, which is our anti-aging blend which is really one of my favorite skincare products that we offer. If you have not made Immortel one of your um, items in your routine, check it out. And um, I, I put a little bit of that on after that. And um, then, yeah, a little doTERRA lip balm. Good to go. So that's what I use tonight. And one of the things that I have loved about learning a little bit about skincare products and what I put on my skin is, to be honest, I will say I was never one of those girls that was into skincare at all until like I got past 50. <laughs> then all of a sudden I thought, oh no, <laughs> I should be paying attention to this, right? I really wasn't. I was like for early decades in my life, I was like, noxema, yeah, and go, oh, and then, you know, just not really ever paying attention to it. But um, as I learned more, and I realized all of the chemicals that are in our products, um, especially our skincare products, um, there are so many chemicals we put on our skin, and it disrupts our endocrine system, our immune system, our hormones, our metabolism. And interestingly enough, I was buying you know, scented fake products because I just like the smell. Um, and also, um, ironically, ended up having fibroids, um, one the size of a small watermelon. Yep, I had a small watermelon fibroid and that was only one of many fibroids. I had a couple pears. They love the fruit analogies. They love it. I mean, I was saying at the end, like if I have a freaking blueberry, I'm going to be pissed. So once I got rid of all of them, but um, yeah, so 
I was wondering why am I doing, why am I getting these things, you know, and it, it could be related to many things, but um, certainly it could be related to chemicals that I was surrounded surrounding myself with. So, and I see in the chat, we've got some good other tips about the mud mask. Um, good for bee, wasp, hornet stings. I did not know that, Wayne. Thank you so much. I do know that people have used it under their armpits as like a detoxifying mask as well, if you need to, if you're, especially if you're sick. And oh yeah, she's, Caitlin just mentioned, on, uh, on the feet and the armpits. Yes, and the feet as well. So that is another great way. So let me go ahead and share my screen. And here we go. Let me just make this small up here. There we go. So <clears throat> we already kind of gave you the intro. So as we're talking, I want you to just think a little bit about, um, you know, what are the things that you love about the skin that you're in and what are the things that you might want to improve, whether it's aging skin, dry skin, um, redness, anything like that, thinking about that. Because what I really think of with skincare is it's really about self-care. This can be a very um, key part of your evening routine, your evening rituals, and giving your skin some love. To me, it used to seem like a chore, to be honest. Like, oh yeah, I gotta, uh, oh shoot, I'm going to bed again without washing my face, right? And moisturizer, what the heck's that? <laughs> um, but now I really treat it as something that is like a self-care ritual. It's part of my you know, nourishing and nurturing myself. And how come my screen sets going to the next one? Okay, there we go. So we, <laughs> somehow we went ahead. There we go. Working that little clicker. Redness, we're gonna talk about redness first. Uh, anybody suffering from redness? Uh, it, it's really rooted in inflammation. That is one of the very common issues that's people deal with with their skin. And it comes from a lot of variety of things, but most of the time it's rooted in inflammation. And so a great product for redness is the yarrow palm oil. So I don't know if I'm showing up there on the screen, but if you can see this. Uh, yarrow palm blend, it's a blend of the yarrow essential oil and cold pressed pomegranate seed. And it can be applied topically to help uh, revitalize your skin, especially aging skin. And also if you have any breakouts or blemishes, you can use it for that. So I'm just showing you, I don't know if you're gonna able to see that. And can you see the blue? It's very blue. And I use this a lot actually. It is one of my, my favorite oils to use for the skin um, outside of the skincare lines that we're gonna talk about. And I'm gonna actually put it on right now, now that I have blue on my hands. So you can also take this internally to support a healthy inflammatory response. And it also promotes healthy metabolic function as well. And so it does come in a, um, a capsule. And I, I can't say I take it every night, but I do take it regularly. And one of the nice things about it too is it, I find it really also helps with my sleep. <laughs> so it's not just really revitalizing my skin, but it's also helping with that as well. So um, another great one for redness is Correct X. So that is sort of like your um, ointment, like a, a more natural version of Neosporin. And that's a wonderful blend of frankincense, helichrysum, um, tea tree, cedarwood, and lavender. And that's gonna be great for any skin irritations to be soothing. And it is free of petroleum, right? So it's, um, it's preservative, a preservative, preservative free ointment. So there, there are no endocrine disruptors like you may find in your usual triple antibiotic cream. Um, and um, so it's very safe and it's safe for all ages. And again, no petroleum in that. So that's awesome because we don't want that extra petroleum. And most products do contain that and you don't really want that in your bodies. And frankincense is also great for invigorating the skin. It also helps to reduce inflammation and 
inflammation is going to be a common theme because that is really um, very closely tied to what our skin is doing. Whatever is happening on the inside is coming out on the outside. Um, Heliochrysum, another one that's a beautiful flower and that has some rejuvenating benefits for the skin and it helps to improve your complexion as well. So that's going to regenerate your tissue. Um, it helps reduce scarring and redness as well and it's going to give you just more of like a little glow, um, sort of a youthful glow. And that's actually um, one of the things that I love about yarrow palm, when I use that regularly, I find that gives you sort of the skin glow. So I'm going to just give you, not on the slides, a little recipe here. There is no slide for this one. And it's called a glowing skin oil. Um, and I'm just mentioning it because I, I made it up in my 30 mil yarrow palm bottle. So when this was empty, I made this recipe. And it is... 20 drops of blue tansy. So again, you're getting that blue, um, shamazzling blue. Uh, 20 drops of lavender, 10 drops of geranium, and 10 drops of frankincense. So that's 20 blue tansy, 20 lavender, 10 geranium, 10 frankincense. And you're going to top that off either with the jojoba oil or a mix of jojoba and rose hip oil. And um, if you if you don't have the 30 mil bottle, you can you can cut it in half and put it in a 10 mil roller bottle. And that's a recipe from Ange Peters, who's a fellow doTERRA leader. And um, she mentioned it on one of her classes and I made it and I have loved it since. And I will put that on before I put on makeup. So that's a good one. All right. So we're going to go on to, I don't know why my clicker is not clicking too well today. It now it just clicked to the end. <laughs> not the end, but fun with slides. All right, so we did Brett. There we go. Scars. Let's talk scars. Uh, usually scars are going to fade over time, and most of us have them from either falling off our bike when we were a kid or on our face from breakouts, maybe in the teen years. Um, and uh, you know, kids get cuts and, and all that. And um, they'll fade over time usually, but a lot of times people really want to minimize their scars. So some great products for that uh, are geranium. That is uh, a, wonder one, a wonderful one for scarring. It's gonna help regenerate tissue and, and tone the skin. Yarrow palm again comes up. Yarrow palm is just like, that's a staple when we're talking skincare. Um, frankincense touch. So that's frankincense that's already in the roller ball. You can roll that on the on the uh, scar. And um, it's always a great idea. It's not absolutely necessary, but I kind of like to have the roller ball um, for frankincense touch, a separate one that I use on my skin. Okay, so if I'm putting frankincense on my feet, I don't generally like to use the same roller ball that I'm rolling on my feet, then put it on my face. <laughs> so you may want to think about having a frankincense touch that's in the bathroom that you're going to just use on your face. Um, and then neroli, that's um, an antimicrobial, so it's going to help reduce pain and, and inflammation, and it's a very wonderful healer. It doesn't just smell good. <laughs> um, it actually helps with healing, and it's antifungal. So um, I, I, it's one of my favorite oils to use for um, just for a perfume, but uh, it's going to be good for the scars too. And I had uh, a pretty massive scars. I had I have a 15 inch scar actually twice um, from hip to hip. And um, I was introduced to the oils about a, a year or so after I had that second time and uh, still had a pretty big scar there. So I love to use the oils on, on that as well. So let's talk about, uh, I don't know why we keep skipping, but let's go back. We have to just keep going forward before we can go backwards. So we'll talk about breakouts. Um, you know, that's something I thought that would end with the teen years, but it didn't necessarily. <laughs> and it's often associated with food sensitivities or hormonal issues or bacteria. So some great um, oils for this would be um, tea tree. That's a wonderful one for, or, or your bottle may say Melaleuca. That was the older name that we were going by, but tea tree. Um, HD Clear, that is going to be one of the, 
products in one of the skincare lines that we'll talk about. And that is a great one to have on hand for any blemishes. And then finally, rose touch. Rose on the skin is just so, um, you know, so beautiful. Anyway, that's another real, um, if you, you know, I highly recommend investing in a rose touch and just having that power of rose. Rose is the highest vibrational oil and I love just putting it in my heart center. But when it comes to skin, you know, and even travel, if I just bring that rose with me, I feel like it does so many wonderful things emotionally and then energetically and then with my skin as well. So you can always just take a little cotton ball or a dropper and put a little tea tree on there and, and do something like that. Um, so that's gonna be a, a great way to use it, just a little drop on your, even on your finger or a cotton ball. There we go, that little thing comes up. There we go. So, brown spots. Um, this can be, of course, from too much time in the sun, just aging or, you know, regular, pigmentation from hormone issues. And um, so this one, of course, kind of hits home as I get older. <laughs> and um, frankincense is going to be great here for tissue repair. And it actually helps lighten um, brown spots over time. So uh, if you do have some like a spot, I know like I feel like I have it a little bit on my arms from the couple spots on my arms from being in the sun, uh, you can just kind of, um, what am I, what is the word I'm looking for? Monitor it a little bit. Just try a little drop of frankincense on there every day for a couple weeks and see what happens. Um, lavender, beautiful. It's the Swiss army knife of oils. We talk about it a lot and it's all things calming. You think about lavender as being calming and it is calming for the skin as well. It's um, great to support healing and maintaining healthy tissue. And then we've got sandalwood. It's a, also another oil that promotes regeneration and helps with toning. And then black spruce is um, kind of a, a surprising skincare oil, I think. Um, black spruce is almost like a toner. You could use it as a toner. So you could use um, a little tea tree and black spruce kind of interchangeably there. You can put it on a cotton ball with some toner as well and just wipe it on your face and um, even do just your chest too. It's a very powerful cleanser. When you dilute it with the carrier oil or um, even something like castor oil, then just put it wherever the brown spots are and um, right from the cotton ball. And it's great for your skin. It smells good too, but it's also good internally. So uh, you know that when you're putting something on your skin, it's gonna help internally as well. So it's just gonna whoop, click on the chat there and see what, We've got going on. We're just talking about how much we love our oils. <laughs> I love it. Don't mind us. <laughs> yeah, I would not have thought, I just learned that um, Julia's OL well with black spruce. It would not have come to me um, for this purpose. But I love, this is one of the things, you guys, that I just love about oils and doTERRA anyway, is that I learn something new in every class, whether I'm teaching it or attending it, I always learn something new. And that's just really fun because we don't have to know everything. Um, but um, we have so much uh, great education and resources. All right, so let's talk about aging. Here's the one close, you know, near and dear to my heart. Um, we are all getting older. We are all aging as we sit here. Um, so that's going to start to be evident by whatever kind of little wrinkles, you know, those little crow's feet or the loose skin. Um, so really the goal is not to, <laughs> I don't like the term anti-aging personally. I like the Me too. <laughs> aging gracefully because honestly, we do want to be aging because the alternative is not good, <laughs> right? So we want to age gracefully. That's my, that's what my take on it. Um, so one of the great uh, products for this, which I mentioned at the start, is Immortel. That is um, going to help to restore your skin. It has things like Hawaiian sandalwood, lavender, myrrh, heliochrysum. You notice heliochrysum comes up a few times when we talk skin. It's a great skin oil. So basically, it has a lot of the oils that we have already mentioned in this bottle. That's a, that's a great one. And um, 
it's uh, if you're more sensitive, you could actually take uh, the top off of this and divide it into two roller bottles. I know that people have sometimes done that and add a little more carrier oil in there. Um, it's anti-inflammatory, antibacterial, antiseptic, and it helps to keep your skin healthy and younger looking. And um, the myrrh, uh, myrrh is also a really lovely choice. Um, that's going to help stimulate your immune system right now, which don't we need a little bit more of that these days? Um, it's going to promote healing and reduce inflammation as well. Again, inflammation, as I mentioned, is going to be the theme. Once you get your inflammation under control, you're going to notice difference in every aspect of your body from like your joint pain to your skin. Um, you can even, um, the myrrh is also good for oral health and for your gums. So you could put a drop with your On Guard toothpaste when you're brushing your teeth. I personally don't do that, but I have heard that tip many times. Um, it's not necessarily something to do every day, but it is great for your gums. So, and again, that's part of your face, even though it's internally. Um, frankincense, again, we've got that coming up for brown spots, scars, and redness, and it's good for all of those things, so it's good for aging as well. Um, so as we say all the time, when in doubt, get your frank out. If you don't know what to use on your skin, um, you can use that. And I was just recently doing uh, a, uh, a Facebook Live on uh, someone's group. I was invited to talk about oils for travel, and I mentioned frankincense because uh, I wanted to mention frankincense because you could really use it for so many things. And same thing with traveling. If you're trying to keep your products minimal, then get your frankincense out. Use it for that. Um, you could make your own rollerball with uh, your frankincense to make it last longer and just roll it on your skin. Top any of these off with fractionated coconut oil and that can just make something um, nice and simple. All right, where's that little thing that comes over here? So we would, how do we make it come up? There we go, there it is. So we would be remiss if we did not mention, you notice a theme, LLV comes up anytime we're talking about health. Uh, our lifelong vitality, because beauty comes from the inside out. Um, and our skin is basically reflecting 80% of what's going on in our bodies. So on the inside of our bodies and 20% and of it comes outside on the outside of our bodies, the old 80-20 rule. So I take LLV on a daily basis just for overall optimum health. And it is um, a great benefit that it also helps my skin. And I'm not going to read off all these um, nutrients that are in there, but you can take a look at them and you can see on this list how many nutrients are in here that really help our skin. And I will say that I have noticed an improvement in my nails as well and my hair. You know, you get your hair shinier, your nails grow more. And so there's many reasons, not just internally, to take your lifelong vitality daily, but also externally as well. So um, great uh, choice for a great foundation for skin. It's going to help feed the skin and it's also going to fill in the gaps um, where your diet might be falling short a little bit. Um, you know, no matter how much we try to eat uh, healthy and eat whole foods and all of that, just our food supply is not what it used to be and we do need a little bit of extra boost there. Um, there's uh, 12 servings of fruits and vegetables in our lifelong vitality. So um, we can't, you know, you should be still eating your vegetables. We can't replace everything with just pills, but this is going to help um, with your foundational skin nutrients also. And Kristen, I just want to point out that Wayne was kind enough to find some uh, recipes for men and include that in the chat. He oh, posted a DIY shaving cream and uh, that calls for sandalwood, peppermint, and melaleuca with fractionated coconut oil, shea butter, and coconut oil. Nice. Also came up with a woodsy beard oil, cedarwood, <laughs> melaleuca, lavender, rosemary, and lime. So, Same. and if you're watching this on the replay and you want these recipes, reach out to the person who sent you the recording. Or the person yes. who invited you. Be, uh, it does show on the, usually shows on the sidebar, so you'll be able to capture them there too. Okay. Um, so when we look at um, internal support, 
we can also uh, take a look at yarrow palm B capsule, which I briefly mentioned before, and that's grape seed and vitamin C that is also in there, which is great for your collagen, right? And collagen is what um, you know pr pr creates that elasticity um, for your skin, and the melon helps for the glowing skin. And then, of course, terrazyme, which is our digestive enzyme, it helps you eliminate, right? If your skin is angry, it helps calm it down and, and eliminate. Helps with your elimination. Um, those digestive enzymes definitely every day. I take them, I try to take one with every meal. I at least get my first two breakfast and lunch always in there. Don't always get 100% with my dinner, but it's critical in growth, healing, and reproduction, all of those things. And um, so I recommend taking it with every meal. And your nutrients convert your energy into your cells. So it works. Um, so Terrazyme, um, we you heard about it in our nutrition and supplement class, kind of works to, uh, someone has described it um, at, like it works like Pac-Man, where it's going to eat up all your yeast and your undigested food and helps make them more bioavailable. And then it's gonna just support your health in that way. And just like with the, um, if you have not tried the Lifelong Vitality, again, we've mentioned in the past that it's a, um, 30 day money back guarantee. So try it. There's no downside. I don't know of anybody who's asked for their money back. Oh my gosh. I don't know what's, what's weird with the uh, slide thing. Okay, we also need to just touch upon our probiotics. Um, PB assist, that's going to again soothe your gut inflammation. So that helps to improve your skin. So, um, We've got that dual capsule probiotic, so it's a time-release delivery system. It's gonna get through your stomach acid and actually get into your intestine, which is where we need it. And um, it's gonna help protect also the sensitive probiotic cultures from your stomach acid. So it gets to where it needs to go, basically, is the bottom line. And it, it's gonna help encourage friendly bacteria growth. And we do need bacteria, right? We want friendly bacteria, and we want a good balance. So this is another uh, piece of that puzzle. And if, you, you know, if you've taken antibiotics, especially if you've taken a lot of them, or even if you've taken any, I, I've only had antibiotics a, a very few times in my life. I think the first one I ever had was, I was in my 20s, actually. So um, I have had very minimal antibiotics, but there are a lot of people out there that have had antibiotics all the time. A lot of doctors will throw antibiotics at you for everything. And that can really mess with your gut flora. Mm -hmm. And to fix that, you need to do something like this uh, probiotic, like a PB assist. And that can come out in your skin if you've got issues with your gut flora and it can cause skin problems. So this is gonna help you know, support your metabolism and also how you're absorbing your food as well. And then last but not least, of course, as I said, water, 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 and our oils can come into play here because we can use them to improve the detoxification, to flavor our water, which can help us drink more. Um, I drink a ton of water all the time. You should drink at least half your um, body weight in ounces. So if someone weighs, let's say 150 pounds, they want to be drinking at least 75 ounces a day. And um, just carry that water bottle with you everywhere you go, that's what I do. And use your oils to make it more appealing if you're not a big fan. I'm always amazed when people say, I don't like the taste of water. I don't like water. I'm like, I don't, I don't understand that. <laughs> it tastes like anything. Rich's uncle always says that, I don't like water. So um, yeah, so I'm gonna, we're gonna look at some of our skincare lines in it now and Caitlin is going to take over there but I'm going to also just mention before I hand it over one more tool that I love with skincare that you can kind of use with these different products she's going to talk about is the jade roller oh so, you beat me to it oh <laughs> There also is a good, uh, great rose quartz rollers out there too. But this jade roller, if you, who has one of these? Drop it in the comments if you use the jade roller. Um, you can use this, you know, all over your face. 
it's really nice if you put it in your refrigerator for a little while and, and so it's chilled and then you get your Immortel and you put it on your face and then you just give your face a little massage. So many beautiful ways that you can give yourself like a little extra love and care. All right. Let's see, what is going on here? I understand what kind of, is that the first one? No. Um, there we so, go. Yeah, Barrage is the first one. Yeah. Now, do you want me to drive or do you want to drive? <laughs> it, it, I, I don't know. I, as long as I keep it here in this little yeah, okay. thing stays on, but I can't have trouble in getting it back. Oh. All right, keep go on. So now we're going to talk about the awesome skincare kits. And you know how much uh, my customers especially know how much I love a good deal. So doTERRA loves our bundles and we save a lot of money when we bundle the products together. So Virage, you can buy these products individually. Uh, you're looking at the toner, the facial toner, it's a spray bottle. Then you've got the cleanser, you've got the serum that's in the little green bottle and you've got the moisturizer. You can buy those individually or you can buy all of them together in a kit and save some money. You can accumulate your rewards and get a Virage kit for free. When was the last time you got high quality, um, clean, clean facial products for free? Um, so the joke is that these products are so clean you could eat them and you know, some of us were without power for a couple days. So the joke was, should we start eating the moisturizer? Um, no, you really don't wanna do that, but you could. Um, and what I personally love is that with most of the products that you're gonna see, the packaging is great because the air doesn't get inside the product and contaminate it. Um, so let's, so the Virage is for aging skin. There's frankincense in there. Um, all kinds of, of good goodness in there. Let's go on to the next slide and let's talk about, um, if we can get over there, I think the next one is, is for the teenagers. Yeah, let's see. I don't know if I have, uh, whoa, where did that slide come from? <laughs> yeah, you've got a different deck than I do. This is going to be fun. <laughs> So HD Clear, this is a um, great kit for the teenagers. You're looking at the moisturizer, uh, the HD Clear oil blend, and then the foaming face wash. The moisturizer is sold out right now. Um, the HD Clear is in the middle. And some people have said that if they have sensitive skin, they'll pop the top off, break it down into two bottles and finish it off with fractionated coconut oil. Um, I don't believe there's fractionated coconut oil in this blend already. It's a blend of just oils. And some people, I just found out, use the oil blend in the middle as deodorant. And I never would have thought of that. So that's really interesting. Um, and the foaming wash is great to use in the shower, apparently. I haven't had a chance to play with these products yet. So let's go on to the next one. And... This is the new skincare line. It's ideal for any age. Um, and you can bundle it again. You can buy the products individually or you can bundle them. And it's, there's an option that's very similar to how you can bundle the supplements. So you can get the cleanser and the moisturizer and then you can add on a few other, I think you get three slots and you can add on a few other and you get a price break. Now, the... Um, the eye cream, which I don't know if you can see me. Yeah, thanks, Wayne. Yeah, so HD Clear does not have a uh, fractionated coconut oil. It's just oils. Um, this is the eye cream. Now, I remember a while ago, I went to a doTERRA training workshop, and it was, oh, let's all talk about uh, how to beat the clock with doTERRA and anti-aging. And I thought, you've got to be kidding. People just age. Just, just fall in love with your wrinkles. Just get over it. And then... I met this lovely eye cream. And I don't know if you can see it, but there's a little roller ball on there that feels so amazing on the skin. So you just push down with your thumb and you see the product comes out at the end. So again, you're not putting eye cream on your finger. You're just rolling it 
right on your eyes and it feels so good. So we actually have hers and hers of these on either side of the bed. I have one at my computer because it is great for eye strain. There's frankincense in here. So when I get a headache and I don't know if it's eye strain or if it's, you know, pollen outside or what, but I can just whip this out and I know that I'm going to feel better. Yep, it helps with dark circles. It helps with puffiness. It just feels so good. And remember how I said, oh, you know, just fall in love with your wrinkles. Who cares about aging? Until I met this puppy. So this does an amazing job of smoothing down the wrinkles that you already have and preventing future wrinkles. I cannot believe how impressed I am with this eye cream. It's just amazing. Sadly, it's sold out right now, so write it down on your wish list. When it comes back, you want to scoop it up. Um, there's also a hydrating cream in here. I got that for my mom, and I tested it out before I sent it on to her. And it, it just one application in my face, the redness in my face uh, toned down. And so that was just great to, to watch the redness go away after just one application. So, um, so let's move on to the next slide. So if you're thinking about what health issues that you're working on, and maybe skincare is one of them. So this is a great suggestion of getting the LLV, getting a price break on the Terrazam, getting a price break on the PB Assist, bundling the Virage together, and getting a price break there, and then you get the free oil of the month. And right now, oh, Julie says she loves the hydrating cream. <laughs> and um, right now, you would get Caraway as the free oil of the month if you order in the loyalty program so that you're earning rewards, and you order before the 15th, and you, you hit 125 PV or higher. And caraway is great for the skin. It's great for detoxifying uh, the liver. Your, your skin is your largest filter organ. Um, it is great for cardiac health. It does, I was reading up on it last night. It's great for digestion. It does so many good things. And you can use it in cooking. Um, so that's a great suggestion of how to improve your overall health, your skin, and get a great product for free as well. Um, yeah, so Julie loves the hydrating uh, cream because it helps in the wintertime when her skin gets so dry. So then let's go on to the next slide. And yeah, you've got a different deck than I do. <laughs> okay, so yeah, totally different. <laughs> So we'll see how this goes. <laughs> um, hmm. So, okay. So I'll just go without the slides. Yeah, cool. All right. So we're done talking about the skincare products. We're going to spend just a few minutes talking about the business side. Um, so doTERRA is different from other companies in general because we've been around for 10 years and we've grown faster than Apple. We do tremendous humanitarian work around the globe and our mission is to disrupt healthcare and to get people out of debt worldwide. Uh, in July, 2020, over 10, we had over 10% growth rate in the US market. And in 2018, 72% of consumers in the United States believed that there was scientific validity to using essential oils for healthcare issues. And there's never been a greater need for people to take charge of their healthcare, get an alternate source of income, get a source of income that you control. Um, so now that we've talked a little bit about the company, we're going to go over why you'd want to work with doTERRA, uh, how you would do this, and how compensation works. And then you'll be able to decide for yourself if it's a good fit for you. Either way, it's okay with us, but we wanna make sure that you make the most informed decision for yourself. So how it works is that what most wellness advocates do, like Kristen and myself, um, there's 
there's two different sides and you can decide how you're going to do it. So the first one is on the customer side. You can meet one on one with someone or you can meet in groups. And that's how they have the opportunity to buy the products. Uh, you would earn 20% on what they initially buy and you get recurring commission on what they reorder. So most people stay in touch with their customers, make sure that they're happy and see if they continue reordering. And how you build your network is up to you. So most people start with the people that they know and they go from there. And the bigger impact you have, the bigger your influence, the more money you get paid. Um, so the other section is about leadership. And that's where you teach other people to make sales in the short term. And in the long term, you develop leaders. So if you choose to do this, you would be paid commission and bonuses based on your overall team, like any other business. So the income potential is that some people share casually. And if you've seen this section before, you've seen the little chart going up. So the people at the low end on the left, they just wanna make a couple extra bucks. They wanna make an extra payment on a bill. And other people want to work really hard. They want to run a profitable business. They might want to replace or supplement their income. And they're on the right, on the upper, upper peak. So think about what option would work best for you. Um, and remember that with doTERRA, we all select our own time and financial goals. And if you would like some training, we've got resources for that as well. So the next step is to talk with the person who invited you to come to this webinar and ask, think about, is there anything else that you need to go over so you would feel more comfortable? And do you want to start earning money with doTERRA? If so, would it be helpful to have the first few conversations together or on your own? So let's open it up to questions and see what people think. How does that sound, guys? Everybody's going to go to, to bed tonight with beautiful, moisturized skin yeah. <laughs> and feeling good. Yeah, anyone have any questions? You could drop them in. We can unmute. You can unmute yourself if you want to ask a question or you can put it in the chat. Thank you, Caitlin. And um, just a reminder that the product of the month, the Caraway that is available, is only available until the 15th. So we have two days left to grab that oil and um, it's uh, not available otherwise. So this is the only way to get that oil. It's not an oil that doTERRA currently carries. And it's a really fun way. I love getting these sort of oils that are not, you know, regularly available to yeah. add to the collection because I just uh, uh, was using the Manuka, which we don't usually get, which I got as a, as a promotional oil. And um, so that's uh, uh, really a great way to, to build your co collection. So any other, any questions? Mm -mm. Well, thanks again. So next week we'll be talking about Sleep, rest, and emotions, I believe. Yes, that's our, our, um, our topic. And so we'll just, uh, let me just grab a little music to head out. And uh, I have no idea what, uh, what I'm clicking on. <laughs> Music you from you whenever it's